name is Artastic and this is day three of the June Drawing Bonanza and today we are drawing a zombie ladybug. I said it was going to get weird because I am reaching for ideas and we are getting creative so I made a zombie ladybug. Zombie ladybug. So grab something to draw with and something to color with. Zombie ladybug. Let's make some art. This episode is brought to you by ArtasticKids.com. If you're a parent, guardian, homeschool family, or a classroom teacher looking for art lessons and resources, begin your journey by finding free art lessons, tips, advice, and more at ArtasticKids.com. All right, welcome to day three of the June Drawing Bonanza, where every single day this month of June, we are going to be drawing together a new video every single day throughout the month of June, so I can help you become a better artist. By showing up every single day to draw, you are going to get better and better at drawing, and you're gonna see your skills grow exponentially. All right, so we're gonna be doing a zombie ladybug today. We're gonna begin with two circles at the bottom of your page. Next, you're going to thicken up the outside of the eyes. They're gonna remain white on the inside, so keep that in mind. We're gonna thicken up the outside. Next, we're gonna draw our ladybug's zombie mouth. So we're gonna draw a nice curving line. And then we're gonna tuck in the corners up and over. From there we're going to draw her tongue on the inside of the mouth and then you can go ahead and color in the dark of the mouth leaving just that tongue nice and white. Alright we're going to draw Ladybug's head so we're going to draw an oval Around. We're gonna add some just some cracks on the exoskeleton here and maybe some fungal patches where it's got some moss or whatever growing on it there. Can have some growing off the edge because it's starting to yeah go kind of bad, you know. All right, we're gonna draw some antennae before we do the rest of the body. Just going to do one line up. And, well, let's we'll make one really kind of messed up. And we'll draw that second part of them. Maybe this one's all free down the end there. Above it, we're gonna draw one line up and two lines out for the back. We're gonna tuck one wing across, and now we're seeing it from the front, so it's foreshortened. We're gonna tuck one wing across and around, and connect partway up the head. And then this one, we'll have it kind of broken and kind of frayed on the other side. Two U-shapes on either side for some legs. And then two more curving lines for the legs in the back. And we'll tuck them under just like that. Okay, we can add some spots on our ladybug. 
And then you can add other details, like maybe it's drooling or something. I don't know. other cracks on the exoskeleton. Fungus. And once you're done, drawing out your zombie ladybug. Go ahead and grab your choice of art making mediums and colors and color it on in. Now I know that ladybug's heads are black, but if I color it in black, you're not gonna be able to see any of the details, so I'm actually gonna do my ladybug gray, and that is my why of doing it gray instead of black. It's because I wouldn't be able to see the mouth, or the eyes, or any of the other details if I do it black. Once you're done coloring it in, your lovely zombie ladybug is done. Well, that's it for this episode. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel, Ms. Artastic. And if you create anything and share it online on social media, please, please, I would love to see it. So take me at Ms. Artastic and I will check it out or join the community and conversation and use the hashtag, hashtag Ms. Artastic and I will check it out that way as well. And you can see what other people are creating who create with Ms. Artastic YouTube videos. Well, that's it for this episode, and I will see you in the next.